A West Michigan couple is sharing their story after they say someone they trusted abused their five-year-old daughter nearly a decade ago. The family belonged to a religious organization known as Sword of the Spirit. They were among several people to talk today during a news conference. They spoke about the sexual abuse their daughter suffered at the hands of one of the organizer organization's leaders. 1300 Sides' Charlie Tinker joining us now. And Charlie, several victims are taking legal action, alleging the organization did everything possible to avoid law enforcement. Yeah, Kirk, that's right. They say church leaders spent years minimizing the abuse detailed in, in some of these lawsuits and refused to discipline these alleged predators as well. Take a listen to Sonia Chernowski reflect on what happened to her daughter, who wasn't then even in kindergarten yet. Because of the relationship we had with Jamie, Treadwell through the sort of the spirit and the 40 year long celebrity and hero like reputation he had in the brotherhood. We allowed him to interact with our precious young baby girls. That is a decision I will regret for the rest of my life. Horrifically, Jamie Treadwell proceeded to groom, cunningly groom and molest our girls. Now, the couple says in 2016 they found Treadwell, who they described as this celebrity figure, a uh, leader within their movement, in a basement bedroom with their five-year-old short of breath and looking startled. Mom says she later told them the two were, quote, tickling and telling secrets. Sword of the Spirit's website says it's a non-denominational Christian group. The Brotherhood, she mentioned, Servants of the Word, is a kind of all-male affiliate founded in Michigan but operating worldwide. Both are named in these outstanding lawsuits, along with Treadwell and Ed Conlin, another authority figure over sexual abuse they say continued for years, was reported often, and allegedly kept quiet from law enforcement. Ed Conlin and Jamie Treadwell are not serial sexual predators, in spite of the servants of the word. Ed Conlin and Jamie Treadwell are sexual predators because of the servants of the word. Yeah, Treadwell did actually face criminal charges in Kent County tied to an investigation by Michigan Radio, which mentioned several other potential victims. He pleaded no contest to two counts of criminal sexual conduct involving a child under 13, sentenced to probation and required to register as a sex offender as well. I did try to contact Spirit of the Sword through the website, but have not gotten a response just yet. Servants of the Word did address the allegations against Conlin in a blog post asking for, quote, earnest prayers for all of those involved in this difficult situation. The ordeal prompting the group's presiding elder to leave his position as of last week. Kirk?